You're so cute with your stick. Yeah, I know everybody on the trail says, oh, how cute. I see your face. <laughs> what you doing in that neck? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> just, just seeing what's up, you know? Oh, you know, or down, or a little to the left, whatever. Are you excited? Hi, Stella. She gets so excited when Cam comes over. <laughs> it was actually our very our first very vlog. First vlog. Oh our God. very, very first vlog. We went on this exact hike. And Stella found. found about a 12 foot long stick. You think it was that long? It was pretty long. I would bet I it was would about say 12 like feet. Eight feet. No way. Really? Yeah. yeah. Oh, well, well, I like to exaggerate because 12 feet is so much cooler than eight. But anyway, for her size, it's pretty impressive. On our way up to Waterfall Canyon, very excited. After about a million pit stops between these two, <laughs> and, uh, we're well on our way up the hill. Where, Stella, wrong trail. This way. This way. Girl. She's starting to feel better. I think uh, right as we got here, Stella got the whiff of some animal that she's never smelt before or felt really scared because she was just sketchy and spooked and all sorts of stuff. But looks like she's back to playing form. Hopefully we can find her a stick and enjoy the rest of this hike. Look at this sight. Nice. <laughs> Just kidding, I'm at the site. Water's flowing nice. Getting my hopes up here. Oh, so excited. Still getting a drink already? Yeah, she doesn't want to let go of her stick. Go ahead, drop it. Get a drink. Get some water. <laughs> You are waiting you, for us? Yeah, I'm waiting because you got your road in swung. All right, let's go. Uh-oh, biker. She's making a tough hike with that stick in her mouth, huh, Stell? Making a very tough hike. Go lay down. Good girl. Sometimes she needs a little guidance on how to cool down. She doesn't know how to let go of her stick sometimes. Huh, silly. Good girl. Hello. Hi. Cute little dogs. Hi. Hi. She's a like, pit bull and whip it. Okay. Pit bull and a whip it. Yeah. Stella, you gonna want a friend like that? We made it. Made it all the way up to the top, and I'm not—I'm not gonna lie. I thought this waterfall would be—I mean, it's tall, but I thought it'd be just like one gigantic waterfall, like thick-wise. That is still very pretty. I love it. Fun day hike. Stella still has her stick. Hey, hey. <laughs> uh, but look at this view. That is so pretty. You want to know what's real crazy? 27 days. This woman's going to be my wife. Oh my gosh. That's less than four weeks. Less than four weeks. As of yesterday, in four weeks, we'll be getting married. Wow. That's crazy. And then you're going to be my little daughter. Yeah, you're going to be my daughter. All right, everyone's clearing out. I think it's about time for us to head. One last look.
So Jess opted to go run off on her own. And I'm just gonna enjoy the little walk back, give my legs a little bit of a break. They are super shaky. I don't understand why. Maybe it's just because they haven't had endurance training in a while or what, but. Hey, Stella. Mama is gonna be back, come here. She's worried about Jess. It's okay, she'll be back, I promise. I think she's about as tired as I am right now, huh? Yeah, stay here, stay close. Good girl. We're almost there, guys, come on. Just a little longer. We're almost there. I can see the houses, don't worry. Thanks. We're going to make it. I have a feeling we're going to make it. Yeah, we're going to make it. I told you we would make it. Stella. What? You're so cute with your stick. Yeah, I know. Everybody on the trail says, oh, how cute. I'm actually surprised you didn't pick up a bigger stick this time. I don't even think I could have walked with a bigger stick. Yeah, you're I'm gonna... having a hard time making it back. <laughs> you are having a rough go, aren't you? Yeah. Well, we're almost caught up to mom. Is someone tired? Sure are exhausted, aren't you? Yeah, I almost died up there. That was like a whole marathon for me. Well, you handled uh, probably, it. Probably, yeah, I handled it really good, but what I was going to say before I was cut off was I probably deserve a waffle. You, I think, do deserve a waffle. Are you serious? Nope. I hate you. <laughs> happy day, friends. Well, happy, as happy food poisoning sickness day as you can be, I guess. Little miss. I'm sick. Oh, little miss has been, uh, she's been having a rough go this morning. Um, she's been up since, well, before I got up, apparently, and been losing her stomach all morning. So, I, uh, working from home for a little while today. Yeah, I'm gonna head in here shortly. I've gotta go give a training on something. So just kind of sticking around the house, basically just helping her with anything she needs. Uh, may have to run to the grocery store here soon to get her some fluids, whether she wants me to or not. Beautiful day though, <laughs> aside from just being sick with what we think is food poisoning. Not 100% sure yet, but as we learn more, we'll update you. So. Hopefully this is just a one day thing, cause ugh, it is brutal, whatever it is. Just said she wanted some fruit punch, but I don't know which one she wants. There's like this one and this one. I'm just gonna get a few of these and then figure something out. Watermelon citrus, all right. And then she asked me to get her some ginger ale. Aha. Let's get two of these bad boys. Oh, the last two. Sweet. Well, headed home. Got all the stuff I need. Poor Jess. Still not feeling tip top at all. And uh, just kills me when she's not feeling well like this. I hate seeing her sick. And man, have we just had the worst luck ever this year with sickness. It feels like once a month so far we're getting sick with something. You know, so it's just, uh, man, it's just like, dang, can we at least not get sick this month, please? Please? Jess has been doing better, a lot better. I got her some medicine earlier. She's been taking that and ever since she took it, she's been zonked. She's just out to the count. So I think it's pretty safe to say that she's doing a lot better. She was feeling a lot better before she passed out. <laughs> so um, I'm, I've considered waking her up just to make her take some uh, liquids, to keep her hydrated, but she, if she's sleeping, I'm gonna let her sleep. So I'll check on her in the morning. But thank you so much for hanging out with us today, guys. I know that it, uh, I don't know if Jess is gonna merge these days or what, but I know that today, wasn't particularly exciting, 
but we thank you anyway for your support. You're amazing. We love you, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye, friends. <laughs> <laughs> How did you do that so easily? Oh, easy stuff. <laughs> we won a pro. Well, he won a pro.